Hey, this is Adam with Tech Dive AV Club and Vegas Pro 19. We're going to talk about lens correction today. So this footage I got is actually from the Vegas 365 feature to get uh, stock footage right inside of Vegas, but uh, we're going to cover this feature of lens distortion and how to correct it here. So in our video effects panel, we're going to find the lens correction feature. You can search for it up here if you're looking for it and you just drag and drop that onto your video. So here let's let's look at a shot that kind of has this distortion here. So to get this video looking, uh, to get this kind of lens on a camera it really does help see a broader area. A lot of times GoPros look like this, um, but this this sometimes is not desirable. You don't want to show the warping, right? You can see with these straight lines here, there is a warping effect where this one, things closer to the center of the lens look straight, but the further away you get to the angles, you actually warp at a curve. Depending on the type of distortion will depend on the type of correction you need to do. Obviously, see this actually makes it way worse. Uh, and if you double click, any of these will go back to normal. Uh, scale will let you zoom in and zoom out. And there, and with the scale, that's helpful because like say if you wanted to add distortion, like make it look like it was on a TV screen, then you could kind of scale up and and you know create the lens distortion that way uh, and fill out the corners. But here is another option you can do too is like right here with this uh, K3 distortion correction it actually really does a great job of flattening this out look at that Just... now nothing is perfect you're not gonna get like an image that was shot without that lens distortion but now when we view this footage uh, it no longer has a warping effect to it. Everything has a very straight edge, straight line look. That's amazing. You can do that so fast and so quickly. So let's take one more quick look here, toggle it on and off. Man, it's such a difference. Um, and remember, just you need to find out which distortion correction works best for your footage. So this one too would also work, but it kind of creates a new distortion. I feel like the K3 for this footage works the best because uh, like I said, it just depends on the lens. Be sure to check and see if you have a particular lens uh, if this distortion is covered here in this found lenses model. So thank you so much for watching. Like this video if you're out. Subscribe if you're looking for more videos like this one. I will see you guys next time. And remember, if you're deciding to purchase Vegas Pro 19, if you do through my affiliates link, that helps this channel out a ton. Thanks for watching.